Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly reading for all zodiac signs. This is going to be for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Before we get into your reading, Taurus, I just want to give you guys a quick update. I want to apologize first that I know we are a bit behind on the readings. We just have a lot of things that are going on right now, a lot of projects that I'm currently working on. I will be giving you guys an update. Um, tons of new videos coming for you guys as well, so you guys definitely stay tuned. We also have the tarot uh, series that I'm going to be uh, uploading on here uh, for those of you guys that are wanting to learn how to interpret the cards. Anyways, let's get into your reading, Taurus. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys for this month. Now, your first card here is the Five of Cups, the Two of Swords, the Nine of Cups, the Five of Swords, Two of Wands, Eight of Wands, Seven of Cups, Page of Wands, Lovers, and the Two of Cups. Wow. All right, Taurus. Beautiful energy. Okay. So off the bat with the Five of Cups, I feel that for some of you guys, um, you guys are really like focusing or internalizing um, your emotions. And it could be almost like a feeling of being on an emotional roller coaster, um, trying to find the balance, trying to be able to see positivity in negativity, um, being able to put energy or focus on what you're wanting to unfold versus focusing primarily on what the current situation is, um, which is a great place to be at, especially when you are experiencing a bit of highs and lows emotionally. Um, being optimistic about the future is definitely something that propels us um, and redirects our energy towards the positive. So I definitely do see that here. Um, with the Two of Swords, being a bit uh, fearful of the future, I feel that for some of you guys, um, this could represent uh, kind of like really thinking about the past, thinking about where you thought you would be at this point in your life and it's almost like a bit of frustration here but i feel that this is very temporary and i feel that it's already passing um you do have the nine of cups indicating to me a lot of wish fulfillment this is manifestations this is uh bringing to you the partner that you've been hoping to find the partner that you've been in search of uh, this is finding stability. This is being emotionally fulfilled, no longer having to deal or carry burdens. Uh, very optimistic type of energy here with the two of wands and the eight of wands. I feel partnerships is going to be very important for you guys. Um, I'm hearing from now all the way to September, even the middle of September. I feel that there's going to be opportunities where it's going to center primarily in relationships. Now, Relationships could be in the love and romance aspect, but it can also be uh, relationships with family member, with friends. It's a deepening of a connection or connections. This is really um, putting effort and energy towards reciprocation. Um, as an example, you know, friends that have been with you through thick and thin, showing appreciation, that type of energy. Now you do have here the five of swords and the five of swords is indicating to me a bit of a blockage when we're talking about relationships and partnerships. I feel that this is something that you've experienced and currently may be experiencing as well. Like I said, I'm, I'm almost seeing like a roller coaster going up and down. So your emotions could be a little bit haywire. Nonetheless, I feel that this is temporary energy. Like I said, you're going to be experiencing almost the world opening up to you, um, giving you a big hug, showing you, uh, bringing to you new people, bringing to you people that are genuine and authentic. Eight of Wands is very quick movement, very quick movement, whereas in the past you felt perhaps stuck, or um, for some of you guys, it could even be that there was like uh, your romance and love department was um, pretty much dead and <laughs> not much movement that's quickly going to be changing as I do see for you guys here having options with the seven of cups and the page of wands communication opening up people revealing their true feelings uh, someone particularly could have had their eye on you in the past um, either ego or pride kind of kept them at bay not really opening up or revealing their interest in you however with the lovers card here and the two of cups 
two of wands and the nine of uh, cups I feel a lot of wish fulfillments are happening for you guys again I feel that this is going to be unfolding from now all the way to September even up to October um, they're showing me almost like the autumn um, season so this is where things start to move in a very positive way in regards to love and romance with the lover's card you may be dealing with the Gemini I do see water energy here as well Scorpio Pisces Cancer type of energy fire as well libra sorry leo uh, sagittarius and aries type of energy with the lover's card though i feel that um you are contemplating and for some of you guys it could be that the reason why you're a bit in your feelings is kind of feeling like in the past perhaps there was a connection or a relationship where you feel um if you would have you know wanted to put more effort or um kind of remained and dealt with certain things you are looking to it as in looking towards it as in i could have you know the outcome could have been very different um if i would have done this or if i would have done that and what spirit is telling you is it's time to let go of that taurus you need to embrace new beginnings and with this new beginning love is by coming towards you it's surrounding you at the present time and the lover speaks about you know making the choice of choosing um not to entertain anything that is temporary or anything that if it's someone that doesn't genuinely spark your interest why put effort and energy towards that it's just wasted energy wasted time scattered energy um it's almost like start dating with purpose taurus um really give the opportunity or give yourself the opportunity to connect with those that you feel very drawn to and like i said if you feel like there's been a bit of stagnation in the love department that's quickly going to be changing as the lovers and the two of cups does promise a very strong connection uh, palpable type of energy kind of like the feeling of you can't shake that person off you uh, the chemistry is very strong and again like i said it may be unfolding for you guys some of you guys may experience this in the next five weeks while others it could go all the way to the middle or end of september so very beautiful energy like i said stay optimistic um try the best you can not to be um harsh on yourself don't be you know don't vibrate from a energy of regret uh what is done is done let it go move on walk with purpose have a crystallized idea of what it is exactly that you're searching for in regards to a partner and don't be surprised when that partner shows up and gives you above and beyond what you've been hoping and expecting or wishing for taurus i wish you guys the very best i hope this gives you guidance uh understanding and knowledge and we'll see each other soon bye